Have you ever wanted to be able to seamlessly send someone a payment link just to be able to collect some information? Well, in Zoho, there are two ways that you can do that. First of all, go to Zoho Checkout, where I am now, and you can create a payment page. Now, you do need to set this up with your Stripe or your credit card payment platform. And once you're in, you can go and create a payment page. So I'm gonna click here, and then I can give it a title, I can give it a description, give it an amount, or if you want to accept donations, you can go and select customer decides on payment page. So this could be if you have created a product and you want people to voluntarily pay you, or if you would like people to select the amount that they're gonna donate as an example. Then you can decide on the frequency, one time recurring, decided at checkout, and then you can put in your terms and conditions, what they would like to do, display a thank you message or redirect them to a particular URL. You can add your account details and you can select your payment default, which will come inside of Zoho Bookings. So once you have created your payment page, you end up with something like this. So you've got an option to check your payment gateway, you can preview it and then you set it as live. So you can set these things to expire. So let's just preview that one now. And this is basically a hosted payment page and it is hosted PCI compliant by Zoho. So then I'm gonna come back and I've gone in and created some custom design behind just to suit my branding and to have my logo there. Then when, you're, when you mark it as live, you can then share the link. So if we mark that one as live, now we get to share the link. Now we can put this as a URL under a button or a link or something like that. We can embed it on a website Let's just say if you were sending a, an ebook or something like that, then you can take the payment and then you can embed the button on another page. For example, have a, a donate, subscribe, pay now, etc. kind of button. All right, so that's the first way to do it and that is using Zoho Checkout. The second way is using Zoho Billing. Zoho Billing, formerly known as subscriptions, allows you to create a payment link that you can easily send to your customer. So you can either create an invoice, send them that, and then there'll be a little button that they can click, or you can go to payments, and then you've got this area, payment links. So you go to payment links, and then you go new, and then you put in who the customer is, ideally if they're in your CRM or if they're already in your customer list inside books. Then you put in the amount, the, the, the description, and obviously an expiry date. So then you can generate the link or save and share. So share will cr create an email and it will send it to the customer. Generate it, a link will just provide you with a URL so you can put it in your own email, uh, whereas the other one goes with an email template. Once you send your payment link, you will then get a notification that it's been paid and you'll get it in the reports here on the home. So that is Zoho Billing and Zoho Checkout and how to request payment through a link that you can send to your customer and allow them to pay. If you found this video useful, please hit subscribe, give us a like and let us know in the comments what else you would like to know. Thank you for watching and take care.